Tiny 11 is the best option available in 2023 if you want to utilize a clean version of Windows 11 with fewer bloatware or you can't install Windows 11 on an incompatible hardware. We will cover a lot of details regarding this tool in this video, along with a security guidance. So what are we waiting for folks? Let's get started with the video. Number 1. What is Tiny 11? Well, Tiny 11 is a light version of the most recent Windows 11 operating system. It is created and maintained by NTDEV. Unlike the standard Windows 11 OS, Tiny 11 can be installed and used on a low-cost PC with just 2GB of RAM and 8GB of space. Furthermore, Tiny 11 eliminates security requirements like TPM and Secure Boot, which are troublesome for many PCs. The default configuration of Windows 11 includes several cutting-edge tools and capabilities that are hardly utilized in daily life. Particularly on less expensive machines, this bloatware will take up more disk space and significantly decrease the computer's overall performance. Additionally, only modern computers with TPM2, Secure Boot, and 4GB of RAM may be used to install the standard Windows 11 edition. This is a significant barrier that keeps people from checking out Windows 11. Now, why Tiny 11 over standard Windows 11? As we mentioned before, not all devices are compatible with Windows 11. Only high-end hardware is supported by Windows 11 due to the high system requirements. Because of this, Windows 11 cannot be installed on the majority of devices sold before 2019. Additionally, the standard edition ships with a large number of drivers and programs that are hardly used in daily life. Because of this, NTDEV launched the Tiny 11 project, which provides a considerably lighter and cleaner version of Windows 11. Number 3. Tiny 11 Requirements In terms of Tiny 11 requirements, Windows 11 will function properly with as little as 8GB of storage and 2GB of RAM. Although running Tiny 11 on 200 MB of RAM is possible, the performance will be extremely poor. Only 6.34 GB of Tiny 11's total storage is used by the operating system. The remaining space is occupied by simple programs like Paint, Notepad, and Calculator. Furthermore, installing Tiny 11 does not require a TPM. Additionally, the Microsoft Store app is still available for use allowing you to download and install any necessary software. And while a local account is used by default in this little version of Windows 11, there is still the option to create an online account. Many features you require are missing from Tiny 11 because to its limitations. The operating system won't automatically update, and NTDEV may release new versions in the future. Remember that the official Windows does not support Tiny 11. Nevertheless, Tiny 11 is a useful tool for desktops and laptops that lack the hardware requirements for Windows 11. Number 4. Tiny 11 ISO for Download Windows 11 Pro 22H2 is the foundation for the most recent version of Tiny 11 OS. Additionally, it offers all the features required to operate Windows 11 smoothly. Tiny 11 ISO can be downloaded from archive.org which is where the project files are hosted by the developer NTDEV. Number 5. Is Tiny 11 good for gaming? Well, we don't think it is good for gaming. Although playing games on Tiny 11 is not an issue, the user experience is not as comfortable as it would be on a normal PC that meets with Windows 11 system requirements. In short, it is possible to play well-known games on a Tiny 11 computer, but it is not recommended. Now the million dollar question, is Tiny 11 safe? Well, you may download Tiny 11 and install in your machine but keep in mind that this is not a pirate product. Just like with regular Windows, the operating system requires a valid license key to be used. The only problem is that you have to believe the developer isn't up to something nasty. Many of these projects have previously been used as delivery systems for spyware or other harsher forms of malware. Although we don't genuinely think Tiny 11 is trying to engage in any fraudulent activity, the fact remains that it's difficult to know exactly what has been done to the operating system in this case. Regardless of a legitimate project carried out in good faith, there is always a chance that mistakes could be made unintentionally. The greatest concern here is that Windows 11 is unquestionably more safe than Tiny 11. 
It removes several security precautions, many of which Microsoft put in place for good reasons. In addition, it may be less secure in other ways that we are unaware of, which might be one of the potential problems we just described. In conclusion, we'd like to say that for those who like utilizing a clean version of Windows 11, Tiny 11 is the perfect solution. It is also an excellent solution for installing Windows 11 on older PCs that do not fulfill the basic Windows 11 hardware requirements. Tiny 11 users cannot update Windows 11 to the newest build via Windows Update. The only upgrades available are for security and the .NET Core. Additionally, Tiny 11 does not support the addition of additional features or languages. Now, before you get away, my friend, can we ask you for a favor? Well, if you think that we didn't waste your time and the video was quite informative, would you please be an angel and subscribe to our channel? Because we really need your support. We guarantee you'll learn something new from each and every video we upload on this channel. Please consider subscribing to our channel because we need motivation. And if you won't, that's fine by us. We're not gonna be mad at you. Anyway, thanks for watching. May your Lord keep you safe and sound.